The main challenges working here were one, it's a living environment. So all the residents live here 24 seven, of course. And I think secondly, it's gaining access. There's a lot of grounds around, a lot of gardens where it don't really lend itself to access equipment generally. The property was about five, six years old. And it was getting a little bit dirty on the outside and on the inside you had wear and tear. So you just wanted to freshen it up and maybe return it to like the builders would have handed it over some five or six years ago. What we've got here is a program. In year one, we paint it inside and out, and then we come back and we do an annual maintenance painting service. But they also wanted to partner with someone who were good at what they do, both technically, but also in the delivery of a service, and that communication is really important. It's one of the good things we've been told by the customers. We were really mindful of the fact that we would be working around people. So in any sort of environment, particularly in the retirement village, when we're working around people, that's probably the number one letting everyone know what areas we'll be attending to and being really transparent and clear on that work schedule. So we had to be a little bit fluid with what we were doing. I have to give credit to both our project managers and our foreman. The communication between both of them and management here was first class. It made them comfortable, you know, have a discussion about what had taken place and what was about to take place. Our best attributes were, I guess, our technical expertise some large booms and scissorless that were needed and also abseiling because some of the areas just cannot be accessed without scaffolding and the customer certainly didn't want that. The well, second would be our experience working in these sorts of environments, so in the retirement village area. The secret to that is being respectful of people and communication. The guys and the girls working on this site were all employees of, of programs, so we do have a lot of control over their behaviour, their communication skills and so forth. That was something the village has complimented us on. They just didn't want to sugar hit as a repaint and then let it go and deteriorate over the next 10 years. They wanted to maintain it. So I think we're able to offer that and all the financial benefits that our programs do offer in the delivery of a service.